According to data available in Hungary, every third victim exterminated in the notorious Nazi death camp Auschwitz-Birkenau was from Hungary. With the 70th anniversary of the liberation of the camp approaching, some of the survivors have been recounting the horrors of the living nightmare they endured. The Hungarian Jews were deported so fast that there were no barracks left. Simply, there were no barracks. We were put into a makeshift barrack that did not have its roof completed. When it rained, it rained on us heavily. It was an empty barracks without the usual wooden bed. It was a completely empty barracks, and 2,000 people were crammed inside. We had to go down to work to a swamp. The fat of the people who were burned was let into that swamp. There is still a small area of that which is slippery. That's where the burnt fat was let out to. In the area next to us, there was a barracks and a football field next to it, where the Germans played football on Sunday. I stood by the electric fence to watch the match. Meanwhile, behind that football field, there were crematoriums, which often let out smoke, and the air was vibrating on top of the chimneys. Somebody who survived Auschwitz-Birkenau is having two lives. One life prior to Auschwitz-Birkenau and one life after and what it is in between, that is something you never get rid of. At least one million prisoners died at Auschwitz, around 90% of them Jewish. Approximately one in six Jews killed in the Holocaust died at the camps. 